there is this singularity in the center. So inside the event horizon, we know that all the matter collects uh, at a point. Now, we can't really predict what happens at the singularity because Einstein's theory breaks down. And we know why it breaks down, because it doesn't have quantum mechanics that talks about small distances. We don't have a theory that unifies quantum mechanics and gravity so that it will predict what happens in near a singularity. And in fact, you know, I once, um, a couple of years ago, I had uh, a flood uh, in my basement. I mean, the, um, and I, I invited the, a plumber to come over and, and figure out, and, and we found that uh, the sewer was clogged uh, because of uh, tree roots that got into it. And we solved the problem. But then it, uh, I, I, I thought to myself, well, isn't that what happens at the singularity of a black hole? Because uh, the question is, where does the matter go? You know, if, you know, in the case of a home, I never thought about it, but yeah. the water, all the water that we use goes in, you know, through the sewer to some reservoir somewhere. And the question is what happens inside a black hole? And one possibility is that there is an object in the middle, just like a star, you know, and everything collects there. And the object has the maximum density that we can imagine, like Planck density. It's, it's the ultimate density that you can have, um, where gravity is as strong as uh, all the other forces. Um, so you can imagine this object, very dense object at the center that collects all the matter. Another possibility is that there is some tunnel, uh, just like the sewer, it, it takes the matter into another place. Um, and we don't know the answer where, but I wrote a Scientific American essay about it and uh, admitting my, our ignorance. So it's a fascinating question. What happens to the matter that goes into a black hole? I actually recommended to some of my colleagues that work on string theory, I, uh, at the closing of a conference, I'm, I'm the founding director of the Black Hole Initiative at Harvard, which brings together astronomers, physicists, philosophers, and mathematicians. And we have a conference once a year. And at the end of one of them, since I'm the director, I had to summarize. And I said that I wish we could uh, go on a field trip to a black hole nearby. And I highly recommend to my colleagues that work on string theory to enter into that black hole because then they can test their theory mm -hmm. when they get inside. But one of the string theorists in the audience, Nimar Khani Hamad, uh, immediately raised his voice and said, you have an ulterior motive for sending us into a black hole, <laughs> uh, which I didn't deny, but 